Hey guys, welcome back to Crown Geek again. This is Shabazz. And today in this video, I'm going to talk that how to fix Microsoft Edge not working, not opening, and if opening, then not responding. So in that case, I'm going to share five solutions that will be fixing all your Microsoft Edge problem. All right. But if you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing it so that you can get all the such related videos based on your browser, your windows and hopefully that you will also like the video if this is helpful for you all right let's start the video the number one thing that you have to do is just come on the taskbar at the bottom make a right click on it and then click on task manager now as you cannot open your microsoft edge you won't be able to do any settings so in that case first we need to fix and so that the Microsoft Edge can at least open. So now in the task manager, you will see Microsoft Edge. So what you have to do, you will go on the very top in the details section, click on it and look for Microsoft MS Edge.exe. That will be having the Microsoft Edge icon. Now make a right click on it and then choose end process tree so what this will do like many times most of the time in fact whenever you try to open the microsoft edge it's not opening just because many other files are running in the background which really stop your edge to come up so once you have to go with end process tree it will give you as the permission just go with end process tree again and now let's open edge again all right it will come up and now if your problem is if it's opening but not responding most of the time it get crashed or it's working very slow so if there is any problem with the microsoft edge then i'm going to share the other methods that will be helping you to fix all those problems okay so the first thing that you also need to keep in mind is that you pause any kind of downloads running in the background. So if you have any uh, downloading through torrent or anything else, if you're downloading, you can try canceling it or either pausing it for some time and try again. So let's move to the number two method that is removing unwanted extensions. So extension unwanted extensions like they take uh, occupy a lot of space and they can slow down your computer because of the memory and due to that it won't allow the edge browser to come up so you have to delete all those extensions which you don't identify or they are not in use so click on the three dot here on the very right and top and then on extensions in my case, I don't have any extension, but even if you have it here, then you just need to look for all of them and whichever you don't identify, you just need to clear delete them. All right. So once you have done this, just close it, open edge again and go with the number three method that is updating your Microsoft Edge. So again, click on the three dot here, scroll down to the bottom, you will see help and feedback and then here you'll see about Microsoft Edge. So chances are that if your Edge is not being updated, then there would be some bug and that only is creating a problem. So here it will say updating Microsoft Edge. I had uh, the updates available, so probably in your case also. So let the Microsoft Edge get updated. So now once updated it will give you this message to finish updating restart microsoft edge so you can click on restart and see if this fix your problem and if not then again you have to go with number four that is clearing browsing data probably you have a lot of data stored a lot of cache and that is creating the problem so again you have to click on the setting three dot here and then on the settings here come to privacy search and services and here you will get the option of choose what, what to clear click on it you can choose this all time make sure that all the options are checked 
except password and autofill form data just leave these two boxes unchecked rest of them should be checked and then click on clear now so once done close the box and try again so now if probably this problem will be fixed but still if you are having the trouble then you can also try repairing your microsoft edge how you have to do just click on the search icon go to settings go to apps and now here you need to search for edge so simply type edge the option will come up here click on it and then click on modify click on yes and this will give you option of repairing microsoft edge click on repair and wait until this process has been completed once done you can try again and i'm very sure very confident that this all the method i gave to you i shared with you this will be helping you to fix the problem and if yes consider like the liking the video subscribe to the channel and i will see you in the next session thank you